Hey y'all, I know it's been a very long time since I've been here, but I'm back. And today I'm going to show you how to make a ghost face mask. The mask I want to make is going to be devil themed. So I'm going to be using red as my main color. Black for the mouth and nose. Red for the horns. Mm, what is this? A 4.25mm hook. I would have used a 4mm, but I lost it. And a 3.5mm hook for our horns. Scissors and a yarn needle. So, yeah, let's get into it. Okay, so when I started off, I did my little notes. Y'all can see this. This is when I made this on a plane. <laughs> I made this on the 4th, but today is like the 17th. And now I'm finally doing the video. Long overdue. But I just measured out like how I want it to be. Worked it and then I made a little mask. Let me go get that and I'll be right back. So this is the first one. I might insert a little clip of it. So yeah, that was the first one. And oh yeah, you also need mesh for the eyes. So I have a lot of little mesh squares. I stack up four of them so it can be dark. But regardless, you can still, you can see through all of this. So yeah, I stacked up four. It really depends on the greater mess you get. So to start, we're gonna make a slip knot. We're gonna chain eight. We're gonna single crochet in the second stitch from the hook. And we're gonna single crochet in the remaining six stitches. Okay, so for row two, we're gonna chain one. We're gonna increase in the beginning. Work five single crochets, then increase at the end. I'll meet you once I have this row completed. Okay, so for the next five rows, which will be row three, four, five, six, and seven, we're just gonna chain one and do nine single crochets. So no increasing for these five rows. And I'll meet you once I'm at row eight or the end of row seven. Okay, now I'm on row eight and we're gonna increase in this beginning and we're going to single crochet in the next eight. Okay, row eight is done. For row nine, chain one. I'm gonna increase in the beginning and then I'm gonna single crochet across the next nine stitches. Okay, so now we are done row nine. We're gonna chain one. And for rows 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, which are 10 rows in total, we'll be increasing at the beginning and the end. So for row 10, we're gonna increase. Now we're gonna single crochet across these nine stitches. Now we're gonna increase in the beginning. this for rows 11 12 13 14 15 16 17 18 19 so for row for the next row you'll do 11 single crochet in between the following you can do 13 15 17 19 21 22 and 25 then 27 so you know you're done when you have an increase 27 single crochet and an increase at the end i'll meet you once i have that done so something like this and that's up until this part so now for like the we're going to need high openings so you really need to pay attention for this next part. Well, we're gonna chain one, turn our work, and we're gonna single crochet nine. Now we're gonna chain one. We're gonna skip this first stitch, and we're gonna single crochet eight. We're gonna chain one, single crochet six. And now we're gonna single crochet two together. I don't even know if that's a single crochet two together, but that's how I do mine. And then gonna chain one, single crochet seven. Okay, so now we're gonna chain one, single crochet six. And 
and increase. I'm going to chain one, increase, and single crochet seven. Okay, so now we're going to chain one, a single crochet eight, and then increase. And we are going to chain eight. And we're going to cut a little tail, not much, and just leave that like that. Okay, now we're going to start the nose. This was the end, and we're working this way. So we're going to count over to the 13th stitch. We ended at 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. Place our hook here, attach our yarn, everybody attaches it the way they want to, chain one in that same space, we're going to single crochet, and now we're going to single crochet in the next six. Chain one. We're gonna single crochet two together. Single crochet five. Chain one. Single crochet two together. Single crochet four. Chain one, a single crochet five. Chain one, single crochet two together. Single crochet three. Chain one, single crochet two together. Single crochet two. Chain one, single crochet two together, single crochet one, chain one, and we're gonna single crochet two for the next four, I mean the next three rows. So we did it once, and now we're gonna do it three more times, and I'll meet you once I have that done. Okay, so now that we're done that, we are going to chain eight. And pull it a little bit. We're gonna cut this. Now we're gonna go back to this one. And we're gonna slip stitch into this first space. Okay, now that's one eye, we have to make our second eye. Okay, so we're still working this way, so we're gonna start at the end and count over nine spaces and insert your hook. Mine will be right here. We're gonna do, insert our hook, chain one, and single crochet nine. I'm gonna chain one, single crochet seven and then in the last two spaces we are going to single crochet those two spaces together chain one single crochet two together and single crochet six Chain one, single crochet seven. Chain one, increase, and single crochet six.
chain one, single crochet seven, and increase. And then chain one, increase, and single crochet eight. a little bit insert our hook into here I'm gonna slip stitch to that first space okay so now we have the eye portion done we're gonna be working on the top of the head so we're gonna chain one so you can crochet in the first 10 stitches. Which is the top of one eye. Make sure to catch that stitch that you slip stitched into. And we're gonna count this, make sure this is eight. Four. Now you're gonna single crochet in the first two. single crochet two together two times I'm gonna increase then single crochet and when the single crochet do two stitches along the nose now we're going to count and make sure this is eight we're gonna single crochet. We're gonna increase. We're gonna single crochet two together two times. And okay, now we're gonna single crochet in these last two chain spaces. And we're gonna single crochet across this last two. Okay, we're gonna chain one. We're gonna single crochet two together or single crochet decrease. I just started hearing it cloaked a second. <laughs> single crochet nine. I'm gonna single crochet two together two times. Or single crochet decrease two times. And now we're going to single crochet six. And we'll single crochet two together two times or single crochet decrease two times. We're gonna single crochet nine. Jeez, why do you keep doing that today, girl? And now we're gonna single crochet two together or a single crochet decrease. Okay, and this is what you should have. So that helps make the eyes like ghost face eyes. And the nose part is larger because you know, to fit your face, that's <laughs> Okay, so we're going to chain one. And for the next nine rows, we're going to single crochet decrease or single crochet two together at the beginning and end of the rows. So for this row, we're gonna single crochet two together or single crochet decrease single crochet 26 then single crochet decrease at the end so you should do 26 single crochets then 24 22 20 18 16 14 12 and we're going to stop on the row where we do 10 
single crochets remember single crochet at the beginning and single crochet at the end and i'll meet you at the end okay so i'm on my final row i already did my chain one i'm gonna single crochet two together or single crochet decrease and i'm gonna single crochet across 10 stitches I'm gonna single crochet two together or single crochet decrease. And now we're pretty much done. We have our ghost face mask base. I'm gonna cut this off. And continuing with your red, you're gonna try to locate the middle or a good midpoint to start this off. We wanna insert our hook and now we're just gonna single crochet around the entire head for two rows so single crochet around once then single crochet around again and what that does is like here it just neaten things up a bit tidies it up and after we finish this we're gonna work on our head strap okay so i already did my first face strap but basically you're gonna put it on like put this on your face and figure out where your ears are and then you're just gonna like insert your hook so i'm gonna do it on the opposite side okay so once you start doing the opposite side just look where you have your first one approximately start at the top it's about here okay um, insert your hook In a chain of 51. I'm gonna come back once I have my 51 done. Okay, so now that we're done slip stitching and we have nine chains left, we're gonna chain nine. And we're going to match this up. And we're just gonna slip stitch it to the head. Leave a little tail that you'll be weaving in. And boom. So you're just gonna do that for both sides and now you have your straps to tie it around your head. Okay, so now that our mask is done, we're going to work on our nose. And for that, I'm using my 3.5 millimeter. Gonna make a slip stitch. I'm gonna chain two. Now we're going to single crochet increase in this first chain. We're gonna chain one. I'm gonna increase into both of these stitches. I'm gonna chain one. Single crochet, double crochet, then we're going to slip stitch into the same spot that we just double crocheted. We're going to slip stitch into the next stitch. We're going to double crochet into the same stitch that we just slip stitched into. And then we're going to single crochet into the last stitch. And I have a little nose. You can leave a long tail if you're going to sew it, but I'm not going to do that. I'm going to cut off a little tail and pull it tight. Now we have the nose for our mask. Okay, now we're going to make our mouth. We're going to slip stitch. And chain five and four this we went back to our 4.25 millimeter chain five and in the second chain from the hook we are going to single crochet we're going to single crochet in the remaining three stitches for rows two through four we're going to chain one and single crochet across there'll be a total of three rows I'm just single crocheting across. 
and I'll meet you once I'm at row five. For rows five, six, and seven, we'll only be increasing at the beginning. So remember, five, six, seven, only increase at the beginning, and I'll meet you once I am completed row seven. For rows eight, three, eleven, which will be the next four rows, we are just going to be single crocheting regular, no increases and no decreases. Okay, for our 12th and final row, we're going to chain one. We're going to single crochet two together. Single crochet three. And single crochet two together. Same thing with the nose. If you plan on sewing it to your mask, you can leave a long tail. But I won't be doing that. So I'm cutting this little tail. Pulling it tight. And now we have a mouth. So as you can see, it's kind of coming together. We have to attach these pieces. The way I'm going to be attaching mine is with hot glue. You can use any glue you want to. Use a hot glue because this is going to be a one-time thing. But for the first one that I made, I actually sewed everything together. You can kind of see it there and on the eyes. 